Irish Shaver 1000 here. I'm going to give you a, a video update on what's going to go on this weekend. Uh, the time of this filming is Thursday. So when you see it, it'll be Friday. So, but while I'm doing that, yay me! Monkey found some more deer. Crap. Okay guys, so I'll be talking to you about what I've got planned for Saturday. And uh, while I'm talking to you about that, I'm just gonna go ahead and put these up. Yeah, I thought I got out of doing the deer this year because you know, it was finally, it was finally done. The deer just wasn't worth trying to find, you know, all the bulbs. I mean, I had bulbs, but it just wasn't even worth it so now these are not animated they are a set of three so they're smaller ones they were 22 dollars i think she got them at the family dollar but she was missing her deer so she came home last night and said because she said she was going to stop the store on the way home she goes she had this in her arms like this she said look what i got it's so like oh man not just one but three we got a set of three lighted deer. They don't, they're not animated. They don't move, but that's okay. She likes her deer. With 60 miniature lights, rust resistant coated wire, easy to assemble, ground stakes included, UL listed for indoor and outdoor use. If one or more bulbs burn out, others will stay lit. You have to check every bulb. Got a little knot here. Yeah, they've been doing that for years, but I remember my dad getting so frustrated with the old screw-in bulbs. <laughs> One light, and you couldn't see through them, you know. So you had to take a good bulb that you knew or maybe thought was good. I seen him one time check a whole set and come to find out he tried a different bulb. And he finally found it, but the one he used wasn't wasn't any good i remember that so anyway we're gonna put we're gonna open these up and we're gonna put them over here at the sand put them over there kind of behind the santa over man what is this parade day <laughs> over by the tree area i wish i had another another uh one of those uh motors i would make this little deer look like he was like hopping up and down you know playing but i don't so but i will have by next year i'll make him animated like we did the santa claus all right let's get this down here we're going to open this up and then i'll start talking to you about the video that's going to be coming up which is my um my fishing overnight fishing trip so looks like my tarp is coming off up here Oh, I see. She didn't tie that back onto that. Oh, man. Okay, anyway, let's get on with this. Okay, so let's go ahead and open these guys up and see what's see what's in here. $22, that's not bad. Like I said, they're smaller deer. Won't be as big as the last deer, but it's okay. She likes her deer, so she says you can do a video <laughs> she always uses that excuse to me you can do a video oh, all right monk well they just kind of got like the fur on them hopefully you guys can hear me i'm I know the sound's only gonna be coming out of the left side of your screen, but or would it be your right side? If sound's only coming out of one side of your whatever, it's because I'm standing on the left side of my camera. And this this camera's got left and right mics on it. So here's the stakes. These things, man, I don't <laughs> so chintzy anymore. Alright. 
we got them wired together that's good and she usually takes the Christmas decorations down or helps me or whatever and she'll she'll put these back in the box that's what she did with the other deer so I hear Bruno in there barking. Yeah, see. Here's the little one. So. Here's the little guy. Oh, they're all wired together. Crap. Okay. I gotta carry these over there where we're gonna put them up. Okay, guys. So, there's our stakes. These must be our stands for the deer. Not sure how they work, may have to get the get the instructions out. I don't know. We'll see. Here's the baby deer. Okay, I see a there's a little nut welded there. So See. All right. Well, let's get these out. Let's take a gander at the instructions. Well, there's a little one. I'm guessing this goes through that nut. And through there like that. And you stake them down. Okay. The problem is the uh, the pretty deer. Let's get his head on him here. Like that. So anyway. So Saturday, I'm planning on taking the boat down. Look at this. These are already coming off. Taking my boat down to the river. Ridiculous. And, uh... the same size here so there should be another nut up here and these things are just popping off like crazy down um, anyway I'm gonna take my boat down to the river and I'm gonna find a spot back in there they said that uh, I went online it said there wasn't any availability, but every time they say that, uh, there's always places down there. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and roll up on the boat, float up on the boat, and find me a spot to hang my hammock up in a tree. I think will be fine. Can't really say anything. Yeah, look at this. This how these these lights go here. I'm guessing like that, maybe. Anyway, now here's the other deer. Alright. 
So we got Papa, Mama, and Baby. There's Papa Deer. So I guess you're kind of limited on since they're Since they're uh, so close together, you're kind of limited on where you could put them. I was wanting to stretch them out some, a little farther than what they are, but that's all right. As long as she likes them, that's all that matters to me. So, I guess we'll put him something like this. I got to make sure I got enough room to run. Yeah, I got enough room there. Let's get our... Our little stakes out here. Sorry about that, guys. These, these ones do give me some zip ties to keep the head on. Our heads will roll. You can see I'm having kind of an issue with the head right now. This has to run in front. I can't find it. So, I'm going to go down. I'm going to do some fishing. I'm going to sleep in my hammock for the first time. I had it set up once, so I'll do kind of a revisit on that, setting it up. And, uh,. Damn it. You know, just do the camp out thing. Yeah, these stakes are so small. I mean, so thin, you know. And I'm pretty much putting them right into sand. Oh, I just got a whiff of that thing. He stinks. Smells like a real damn deer. Actually, a real deer smells better than this thing does. Woo! <clears throat> the light popped off here. There we go. Damn. Jeez. So I kind of wanted to put one here, one back up in there, one over there, but I guess it's not going to be that way. It's all right. Still got our little deer family here. Kind of. That way they're looking at her when she comes in. I'm going to turn one out like that towards the road. Now I got one more stake to put in this little guy here. We'll turn him a little bit. All right, the deer are installed. Okay, now, let's talk about the trip. We'll come back out tonight and check them out and see what they look like. I don't like her there. I'm gonna move her <clears throat> kind of back here a little bit. There we go. Now, I'm going to turn him too, so.
Alright. I guess they'll be alright. They are pretty. Like I said, it'd be cool to be able to make him look like he's jumping up and down and playing. But. We get, get this plugged in. There we go. Alright. Again, let's talk about the trip. Okay, guys, so sorry I brought you along for that, but that in itself wasn't going to make a video. You know, it's too long to make it short, but too short to make, you know what I mean. Uh, same way with this. It's kind of a little update to let you guys know. Unless uh, weather's supposed to be fine, I checked the weather report, it's supposed to be okay. Um, decent weather, 80s which that's kind of hot but i'm going to be going late afternoon probably about two or three and uh probably two so i can get back in there check out my site set it up do a little fishing and then i'll probably leave about noon on sunday because you know monkey's back to work kind of she's in the office now i think i mentioned that but so i can't do it through the week so this is really the only weekend i can do it <clears throat> is this weekend coming up so, uh, but just talking about that one enough. So, you know, I want to give you guys, you know, a few minutes of a video. Uh, but, yeah, the deer, I think they'll look all right. We'll check them after dark and see. Um, kind of like a mini review. And, uh, let me see. But, I want to take the boat out. So, tomorrow, which is Friday... But you'll be seeing this today. <laughs> you'll be seeing this on this video on Friday. So I will have a video up for you guys Saturday, even though I'm not going to be here. Sunday should be my camping video. Um, but I will have a video for you guys Saturday. Um, so, but tomorrow, I think I'll bring you along with me. We'll start the boat up. Uh, I almost said it hasn't been started since the last time we took it out. Yeah, of course. I hate when people say it. That thing hasn't been run since the last time I drove it. They don't tell me nothing. But, you know, it, it has been a little while. So, you know, I'm going to get the batteries charged up on it tomorrow. That one's still reading 12.1 volts. Uh, that one I know is dead. We killed it last time we were out. That battery's getting old, too. That thing... It's what, about four years old now, so maybe five, four, it's, I know it's four years old. Uh, all the light, the lights are working except for the blue interior lights. I don't know why they quit working. I got the switches covered up. They, they're not getting wet. So I think it's a wire problem. Those LEDs are just such tiny wires. And if even if you solder them, uh, they'll break right at the solder usually. So, uh, get, get these leaves out of here. It did rain last night. So, we'll get these leaves out of here and uh, just kind of make sure it's ready to go. And then we'll go take our trip. So, hopefully, we'll catch some good fish. Um, I'm only going to bring two of my fishing poles. Uh, that's all I'm going to need. So, uh, we'll do some fishing, maybe some fishing from the bank, but we'll do some fishing from the boat. Instead of going down river first to try some fishing spots, there's a couple spots last time Monkey and I was out up the river that I'd like to go check out. Uh, my friend actually has a place over there. He's got a big long dock and stuff. He's got a dock that goes out to the... But uh, I'd only been to his house once and it kind of zigzags back through the forest to get to the river. And me and Monkey tried to get back in there one day and I, <laughs> I didn't know how to get there. And how to get there from boat, but up past that there's um if you stay on that river from uh it'll take us right up to where we camped out at the riverside lodge remember we were on that we had the big pavilion i called it glamping it'll take us right up to there um, but in between there and my friend's house um, it's kind of sparse. There's hardly any houses up through there. There's some places look like it, I might be able to get back into and check out and maybe do a little fishing back in there. We'll just have to play it by ear. 
Um, so the headlights are working, so I don't have to worry about that. My nav lights are working, don't have to worry about that. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do anyway. Thanks for joining me, guys. And uh, as soon as it gets dark, we'll take a look at the deer together. So, but I'm going to say Shea Bear, the myth, the man, legend. I'm gone for now. Bye-bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to visit Monkey 1000 channel. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy the clip of the reindeer. <laughs> see you guys. Bye-bye. Okay, guys. There's the reindeer. You can see everything else is on. The reindeer or not. Piece of shit. A big bag of shit. Jesus Christ. Now, I know it's not my plug. Because this is what the Santa Claus is plugged into right here. See, if I unplug him. Now I'll plug the reindeer in to the same spot. Hang on. I'll plug the reindeer in to the same spot as the Santa Claus. Nothing. That blue light you see is coming from that thing over there. Nothing. Now, if I plug this back in here, same spot, Santa Claus comes on. I know what my ha haters are going to say. What do you expect for $22? I expect the fucking things to work. Man, that sucks! Have a good one, guys.